Hey, it's Keanu the Day, and I'm about to play Picks or It Didn't Happen. Oh, it is my last show that I did at UC Merced in California. The story behind this is I forgot my outfit in LA, which was like four hours away from the show which was really depressing because my outfit was amazing. And then I got there and I took the shoes out of my bag and I was like, outfit. Where the f is my outfit? <laughs> and we were literally in the middle of nowhere. Like you see Merced is like an hour away from like an actual mall. So we went to an outlet mall. We went to JCPenney and got myself a new outfit. This was a, a button up and I ended up just tying up the button up and it had bell sleeves though, so it was pretty on brand. And then uh, the pants, we're just some old lady pants, but I pulled it off. Yeah, wow, it's depressing. <laughs> This is a, a BTS photo of me laying on the floor for a magazine shoot at the beach. And I feel like without any context, this would be really interesting. So I want to send it to somebody interesting. Let's send it to my best friend, Chelsea, because she didn't even know I did this magazine suit. So she's just going to be like, what is happening right now? Let's do it. <laughs> Sending to Chelsea. There we go. Done. She's really nice. So she's probably just going to be like, oh, that's cute. <laughs> Wow. Wow. Okay. This is from the Broad. I went to the Broad recently. And I feel like this is just me. Whatever this is. This is how I feel. This facial expression. When I wrote, all we do is f***ing regret it. F***ing forget it. I feel like he's kind of like really regretful about whatever is going on in his life. And then there's this guy who's his companion. All we do is f*** them regret it, f***ing forget it. Um, okay. So, I don't drink or smoke. Uh, my best friends can get pretty drunk. And that's when I feel like everybody's finally on my level. So we went out for my best friend Chelsea's birthday party and this is me grabbing her tits because this is something that we do in pictures when they get drunk and they're finally on my level. Yeah, I don't think there really needs to be much more of an explanation. They were drunk. I act like I'm drunk when I'm sober. So I'm grabbing her tits. And then there's also a really weird video of some guy taking his pants off, also for her birthday. <laughs> and he dropped his phone, which was really depressing for him. That was a great section. That was probably the most eventful section we could have stopped on. I'm really happy about that. That was lucky. Maybe Daniel was the last one. Oh, that was... I just scrolled past a show that I got kicked off stage because I couldn't stop saying f on stage. And it was at The Grove. It was an all ages show. Okay. This is me and Daniel. I opened up for him in my hometown, Phoenix, at the Celebrity Theater. It was really cool because the stage was a rotating stage. It was a 360 room. So it was like you're, I was literally singing to a different person like every three seconds. It was awesome. Um, and he killed it. His music is amazing. And he's really cool. He's Canadian. He's just really nice, you know? Hey guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe for more videos from your favorite artist. And while you're here, check out these other videos.